Hello everybody, welcome back to our channel. I am Bimal from How to Geek, and in today's guide video, I'm going to show you how you can download the WordPad application on your desktop or your laptop. And also, I'm going to show you how you can log into your account on your WordPad. To do that, what you want to do is if you're on your Windows 8, 10, or 11, you simply want to go ahead and open the Microsoft Store over here. If you can't find the option Microsoft Store, simply click on the Start button and search for Microsoft Store. Wait for the Microsoft application to load and then you want to make sure that you're actually logged into your Microsoft account. If you're not logged into your Microsoft account, then you won't be able to download the application on your Windows. So, in order to download WordPad application, at the top of the screen you can see the search box. Simply click on the search box and type in WordPad. Once you type in WordPad, you can also click on search right over here or you can click on the application which we are going to download. As you can see the first app which comes up is called WordPad, free books and stories. What you want to do is simply click on WordPad right over here. And on the left hand side you can see the option called install. Now in order to download the application and begin the downloading process, you simply want to click on install. You want to make sure again that you're actually logged into your Microsoft account on your Windows. If you're not logged into your Microsoft account, then you will not be able to download the application. So simply wait and be patient and wait for the application to download on your device. As you can see, we have successfully downloaded and installed the WordPad application. Now in order to open the application, simply click on open right over here. So this is how you can download the WordPad application. Now here we have been given two options such as sign up or login. Now if you don't have an account then you simply want to click on register on or the sign up button right over here or you can also click on continue in order to sign up with your Facebook account if you already have a Facebook account and if you are okay to link your Facebook ID with your WordPad ID. But on the other side we also have the option called login. Now here what you want to do is simply enter your username or your email and your password. Once you do that at the bottom you will see the login button will be enabled. Currently it is disabled because we haven't entered our credential. So you simply want to click on that and click on login or if you want then again you can go ahead and choose to continue to log in with your Facebook account. And so in this way we can successfully download and log in to the WordPad application on your Windows. We hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy then do make sure to leave a like, comment and subscribe and also make sure that you turn on the bell notifications in order to get notified whenever we post a new video. As always thank you very much for watching and see you in our next video.